From when Brooks Brothers began some 55 years ago as timber porters on the River Thames, Brooks Brothers has developed into one of the largest privately owned timber imports and merchants in the UK today. Brooks Brothers imports hardwoods and softwoods from around the world and we sell those hardwoods and softwoods out to the joinery trade, the timber merchant trade, in fact any business that buys timber. As well as selling the core item of sawn timbers, we also have a very large manufacturing capacity throughout the country now. Brooks Brothers is a national timber distributor from this site in Skelmersdale. We supply our customers, joiner companies, merchants with timber related products, hardwoods, softwoods, sheet materials, flooring, tech products, engineered laminated products. I run the the day-to-day -day outgoings of the mill, which is running the moulders, the saws, the priming line, making sure the quality's there, getting that end result. It, it's getting that perfect piece of timber at the end of the machine and, and the customer being 100% happy with it. Uh, within Brooks Brothers, it's very dynamic. We look at changes and trends out there and we don't have a big hierarchy that we've got to report to to, to be able to get answers. So within a couple of hours, I could be straight to the the director or the MD to get an answer on what we want and things can be implemented quickly. It's no good us providing a service or providing a quality if it doesn't meet their needs and every customer is different, every customer is individual. If a customer rings up today and they need a job tomorrow, even if it's lacquered or primed, we, we make sure they get it the next day. At Brooks I'd like to think we've done things a little bit differently, mainly because of the knowledge of our staff um, and the personability of our staff. Whenever you phone up, you will be met with someone who has been in the timber industry for a long time, with a lot of knowledge, and who will try and meet your requirements. Well, I first started at what was Fitchett and Wallacott, now Brooks Brothers, 27 years ago. and It was a very established old company. Brooks Brothers are slightly different, it's a much younger company. It's very enjoyable, with both companies have been, been good to work for. Our mill here in Nottingham is very much geared up now for doing any profile anyone would require, and also for large runs of that profile are likely planed all round. We can do sanding on site, cross cutting, we've got a beam saw for cutting sheet materials, so pretty much any machine requirement that would give added value to your business is available from Nottingham branch or from the other branches as well. I've been running Broadhead Cabinet Makers for eight years and I use Brooks Brothers for most of my timber. Brooks fits in very, very well. They're always on hand whenever we need them. They've got some of the best quality timber that we like to use. We like to use the best quality products and Brooks have been very good at supplying that. We deal with joinery manufacturers, other timber merchants, boat builders, shop fitters, schools all over the United Kingdom, even people who do their own small craft projects. Sawn, hardwoods, softwoods, sheet materials, panel products, flooring. We have a retail centre, so basically for any of your timber needs, we can provide. Whether it's a large inquiry, small inquiry, everything gets dealt with with the same professionalism and speed and everyone gets prices back as quick as possible. When first driving down the lane, and you're thinking you're going to be turning up at a very small timber merchants. Um, you drive down this country lane, you get to the end, and then it opens up this 12 acre site. The company's grown considerably since I started there. Um, I think we had on the site itself was probably 30 people at Danbury, whereas now we're up to just under 100. So the timber that we use as a company, we can't find anybody better than Brooks. Simply because of the service we get, the prices are always right. The environmental issues that surround the whole timber market at the moment, we know that we can rely on Brooks Brothers to be correct in that respect. And the quality of the timber is sound and in the after sales is excellent. Our largest production facility is in Danbury, where we have 10 six and seven head moulders. Primarily, we're running Vinic Powermat moulders, which are some of the best machines in the world. They run at 12,000 revs per minute, which is twice the speed of a traditional moulder. That produces an excellent finish, particularly on hardwood. It's also computer linked to the tool room, so setting up is really quick, 
which is very advantageous for shorter hardwood runs. We also have a Taylor laminating press from America, which offers bespoke laminating to back up our X-Stock products of Brooks Tech, which are in oak and European redwoods. At Danbury, we also have a paper and foil wrapping line, which can apply foils and veneers to any substrate whatsoever. All three sites now have paint shop facilities offering staining, lacquering and fully finished paint systems. The finishing systems are all water-based and are applied by vacuum coater. Every machine that we have also has a denibbing head on it to ensure that the finished product is as smooth as possible. Customers of Brooks Brothers have access to over £14 million worth of landed stocks. As well as our own landed stocks in our own depots, we also use storage facilities around the quays of the United Kingdom. This way we can offer sawn hardwood deliveries within 48 hours. To make sure everything's perfect, we, we check the job from start to finish and through every process we go through. Once it's cut to make sure it's the right size, it's then signed off as we run the job. It's then signed off after we sign the job and then it's also signed off when it goes through the priming line or the lacquering line to make sure it's perfect once it gets to the customer. Joined a company in Nottingham about 20 odd years ago called Fitchett and Woolacott and they had a flooring division there so obviously that's where I became aware of flooring. I joined Brooks 12 years ago to set up a flooring business for them from Fitchett and Woolacott. We carry somewhere in the region now of probably 1.2 million pounds worth of stock. We have showrooms in Nottingham and in Essex. Both of those who have just been refurbished so they are up to date with our latest products and colours. We were very much in the early days a business that followed the trends. We now recognise that we have an opportunity to be a trendsetter and I believe that the market is right as we sit now for us to take our place really up there as one of the established and recognised businesses in the UK. At Brooks Brothers our aim is to be a quality timber supplier so we're constantly proactive in searching out suppliers that can provide us with not just a timber product, but a quality timber product. We have many long-term suppliers that we have close relationships with. We do take time to understand how their businesses work, their strengths, their weaknesses, their capabilities, and we work with them. They're as just as important to us, our business model, as our customers are. My job's very rewarding, being able to see the logs being cut, all the way to the guys taking the orders on the phone and seeing the stock go on the lorry and then visiting our customers and seeing the final product. To be able to follow that start to finish chain through, you really do see firsthand what a good commodity timber is. So I come with an environmental background and working in a company like Brooks Brothers, there's an incredible opportunity and a responsibility to positively influence how forests are managed. And that's to ensure our compliance with the EU timber regulation, but also to make sure that we know what we're buying, where we're buying it from, and that we can pass that assurance on to our customers. We source from companies that manage their forests sustainably and are able to verify that through independent certification according to credible international standards. We can also work with companies that perhaps struggle to make the leap to sustainability and we can work with them to support them to transition to more responsible practices. If we manage forests responsibly and ensure that we have a continued supply of timber, it also builds value for forest managers to keep it standing and to not convert it to other land uses. I think the, the common misconceptions about the timber industry, particularly for young people, is that it's not going to be a great career. But that couldn't be further from the truth. Many of our 
brightest, best managers started in the yards as young people straight from school and those people have, have learnt the trade and worked through the business and some of those people are now managing some of our multi-million pound departments and it's a great credit to their ability and something that as a company we're very, very proud of. The opportunities that I've been given over the years have been fantastic. The company is still extremely driven on looking forwards and improving and I feel I can have a, have a part to play. The reason why I continue working for Brooks is the fact that there's always been new challenges. I've always been given the opportunities and I've been rewarded for the challenges. So to actually now become a director of the company that I started at 18 years old that's the pinnacle of where I wanted to get to and I remember sitting in my interview with the now chairman Mark Sheriff and he, he said to me one day, he said you want to be in this chair, which I think is great, I think that just shows it is a place with opportunities if you're willing to put in the effort. I'm, I'm immensely proud of all the people working with Brooks Brothers, not just developed fantastic working relationships but see a lot of them as very good friends who will help me and I'll help them away from the office also. I've been in the timber trade all my adult life. Um, I have equipment at home, lathes, uh, so that the passion of timber isn't just at work, it's at home as well, so timber is my life. Our people mean everything. They are our biggest asset by a long way, and I personally pride myself in recruiting the best people for the business. And Striving to be the best is really day in, day out what we're all about. A great deal of the success of Brooks Brothers is certainly down to the personnel and the people it employs. We want to be the best and I think we're getting very close to it.